Okay, hello guys. Today I'm going to show you how to make a single chain loom bracelet. Um, all you need is one hook, a rainbow loom, and a few colored bands. The first step I do is I watch my red arrow, and it should be pointing this way. So as I start, as I start at these two pegs right here, I strap my first band on like that. I strap my second band on like that. And I repeat the process until my band has, um, I better show you actually. So I just keep doing this. And I'm just going to pause the video and unpause it once I am done. Okay, so yeah, I've gotten to the end pretty much now. Now, as you can see, I put my last one on and you don't go totally to the end, so you should have three pegs left. And this one should be, the last one should be pointing up. And so what I need to do is I'm gonna grab one more. And I'm gonna make a cat band. So all you have to do for that is you have to take your fingers, your two fingers I use, um, and I wrap it one, two, two times. Uh, my fingers and I put it right on top of my last band so it should look like that then what I do is I use the looming I do the looming process with my hook so first I go under my cat band and I get my purple purple band and I hold down my cat band for resistance like that then I go under my purple band and grab my yellow band. And then I repeat this until I get to the end. Okay, once the looming process is done, you should have something that looks like this. And what I do now is I take my C-clip and I string it on the last one. This takes a bit of practice to do. Make sure you get all your bands. Sometimes I like to use my hook to assist me. This is a bit of tricky stuff. So make sure to like and subscribe. There we go. And now I like to use my hook. So what I do here is I grab my hook and I kind of stretch it out like that. Oops. Drop my seat quick. And I just put it on. Make sure you grab all your bands like I said before. I like to kind of do it outwards so they don't all get mixed up. Like that, and boom, it should just be on there. Let go, and you can pull it off the loom. Just be extremely careful at the end because you could ruin it. And so now what I do, I'm very careful at the end. Let's see. Once everything is loomed, you should have something that looks like this. And it's all off the loom. Now what you're going to do is you're going to take your end, put your two fingers in it, and slide it through your seat clip, and give it a stretch. You are done. Please like and subscribe.